A dance of disguise and desire, unraveling Tengna gels for Tumnus and Pomona. In the world of 17th century Dutch art, Jan Tengna gels masterpiece, Vatumnus and Pomona, stands as a testament to the artist's ingenuity and mastery over his craft. The painting, dated 1617, is a visual narration of Ovid's tale where Vatumnus, the god of seasons, adopts the guise of an old woman to woo Pomona, the wood nymph. Tengna Gel's rendition deviates from his contemporaries by presenting Pomona fully clothed, a departure from the voluptuous nudes popularized by Mannerist artists like Abraham Blumet and Hendrik Goltzius. This choice aligns with 16th century traditions but also introduces a unique perspective on Pomona's character. The painting is steeped in symbolism, every object meticulously crafted to narrate a story beyond the visible. The walled garden mirrors Pomona's preserved virginity. Her foot resting on a stone symbolizes her steadfast rejection of suitors, a narrative enhanced by disguised symbolism. Amidst this allegory lies Vatumnus, his disguise not just physical but symbolic representing changing seasons and transient emotions. During this era, Ovid's metamorphoses were celebrated, yet Tengnagel's interpretation was singular amongst pre-Rembrandtists. His focus wasn't just to depict mythological grandeur but to bridge it with contemporary ethos, making mythology tangible and relatable. Despite being fully clothed, there is no mistaking Pomona's attire for contemporary dress it echoes pastoral themes found in works by Peter Lastman. Similarly, Vatumnus robes are reminiscent yet distinct from earlier depictions, marking Tengnagel's signature style that marries historical reverence with innovative expression. The overflowing objects in this tiny painting aren't misplaced, their symbolic narratives echoing southern European gardens yet laden with profound meanings that transcend time. Vatumnus and Pomona isn't just art, it's a narrative tapestry weaving mythology with realism, tradition with innovation. Every stroke echoes Tengnagel's mastery in bringing mythological tales closer to human experience while preserving their ethereal allure and artistic dance between disguise and desire.